as is tradition, someone's camera cut midway through the video, but it was Knife Stalker at the start of this video, so he will appear randomly midway through this video, but he lost the footage. So, enjoy the first few comments that he reads, read by me. You know what? Every time I sit on Pikachu, he gives me like an electrical shock right on my rectum and it hits my butt. Hey guys, what's going on? I haven't seen you guys since last year. <laughs> yeah, I try saying that with a straight face. So today, today what we're doing is, you know, we did a thing called the Ultimate Smash Brothers. I don't know if you remember it. I, what, what was the Ultimate Smash Brothers? A fan film of Smash Brothers. Yeah, no, like, I was in the Ultimate Smash Brothers. I don't know if you guys remember, but I played Ash in that show. I totally look like that guy. True. You do look 10 years old. <laughs> but. And a crack it. Yeah. Boys. But today, we are here making another reading comments video. And today, dedicated to only Smash Bros. Mm -hmm. Because that is our most popular series right now on the channel. I wish. Still outside but, of fucking unknown plumber. Yep. But here we go. We have the playlist set up. And to start off with, we're going to see if there's any on the production teaser announcement. That came out 10 months ago. Jesus 10 Christ. months ago. Ooh, there are some comments. No. <laughs> All right. So, whoa, you want to go down and up or up and down? Down and up. Down and up, okay. So from Memento Mori, yanked a uh, Yankee. Yeah, Yannick approved. Yannick it, approved. He's another. He's friends with Yannick, another subscriber. I'm like, yay, he approved. Okay. From Wolven Swiftwin, let's uh, go. Mushroom Kingdom, here, here we, we come. come. Sorrowful rage, very cool. Thank you, sorrowful rage. Short I'm... and sweet comments for the teaser. Uh. Until we get to the amazing <laughs> copycat with his amazing paragraph. One, Link with a gun, Snake with a sword, and then Link with a massive sword, and then Snake with a shotgun. Will they make up their minds? Looking good so far, too. But being this is the Super Smash Brothers, Snake will blow away everyone and or everything in the multiverse. Three, that's Snake for you, always blasting some things or someone. And then you replied with, glad you noticed the weapon change. <laughs> <laughs> I, I love you so much, copycat. <laughs> and then we go to the official trailer for Smash Brothers. First we have from Ghost. Let's go, Ghost! I'm sorry! Yo! Damn, that's some acting right there! Woo! Who says, yo, fire. No, 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 you gotta read it right. Yo! yo. Uh, Danny, I don't know if you remember her, but you met her at the Chick-fil-A parking lot. That oh, was yeah. my sister. Uh, she said, yes, sir. Noise. Oh, Jesus. Uh, the copycat. Uh, <laughs> your turn hey it's shorter uh once again it's good versus evil and it looks like someone is operating behind the scenes as optimus prime would say one shall stand one shall fall <laughs> one and two and three uh, uh, maybe both will fall memento mori said incredible well thank you danny commented twice i guess uh, saying, keep up the good work, y'all. Love you, Danny. Oh, hi, Danny. Crazy Hanna Creations. Oh my gosh, this looks awesome. I can't wait to see this. Oh, you want me to pretend to be you? Yeah. No, oh, thanks. This was honestly fun to make. Uh, I had, um, I, uh, I've had, um, in cosplay gear, lol, McCarrie. 
You kind of sound like Mr. Mackey from South Park sometimes. You're welcome. I can't wait. <laughs> see what happens in this? It looks amazing. And then, of course, you self plugged yourself a few months later saying, oh, 342E HTTPS uh, semicolon dash dash YouTube dog. <laughs> 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 And then Profusion, who's my friend Jaden, said this. So this is what Shady has been up to. I know, I need this to upload. This trailer looks cool. I was such a huge fan of The Legend of Zelda show, and I've been waiting for this sequel since Link said it. I made a promise. So excited to see how this story concludes. Also, BT Dubs, glad to see both the people from the 300 video. Shady made are both in this. They were so damn entertaining to watch. Yeah. And of course, the final trailer. All right, we did a final trailer. Oh no! From Ivan. Real. From Nakia. Nakia. Noise. From Nacho Taco 101. Well made. Thanks, two years in the making. From Cole Sorello. You guys are in for, oh wait, hang on, I gotta read it like him. You guys are in for a treat. Get ready, hot shot. Oh yeah, New York. I'm gonna make a series. I'm gonna, oh yeah. I'm gonna fucking make a fan show where it's gonna be like, how to be Xanderbrow, how to be Cole Sorello. And I'm just gonna pretend to be you guys for like a video or something like that. <laughs> Random yeah. test. Okay. Random <laughs> test said, Ah! Been winning since Zelda! Can the show come out now? I'm glad you're still watching. To go broke. Oh, oh, uh, you've been a fan of me for a minute. I remember you. What's up? Uh, let's go. I'm so excited for this film. Shady mentioned this is the biggest film he has ever worked on. Been around since the jailbroken days. Thank you. Uh, if you're reading this, good luck to all of you. You guys fucking rock. Love you. Uh, thanks, man. We filmed this uh, within the span of two years. I'm so glad it's finally here. Smiley face. From Jaden, our Profusion Studios. This is gonna be sick. This trailer is the coolest thing I've seen all day. How long has this been? Um, how long is this film going to be or gonna be? Two hours. At the moment. <laughs> Copycat shortest comment here. It's almost here. So bring it on. So what were we gonna say, Reese? Uh, from Crazy Hand. You wanna read it? Creations. Woo! I can't wait for this. Let's go. <laughs> uh, I'm so glad you liked it. <laughs> no problem. I cannot wait to see it. From Danny. Yeah. That was amazing! <laughs> you wanna try that again, buddy? <laughs> you wanna try reading that again? <laughs> I'm yeah, so yeah. excited to show this bad boy off September 24th, baby. There we go. That a boy. Hey, Tommy fumbles. All right. And now we're on Smash Bros. Episode Fucking one. Cosmo. I, I, I would have cried if this was a trend for every fucking episode. Where are the driving blocks, Shady? Yeah, Shady. Where are... <laughs> Do it or you are a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, did I did you comment that or yeah. did I just Okay. <laughs> I am not I did not make a driving vlog yet. We'll do it. We'll try to publish right now. <laughs> uh bro, can we talk about Waluigi and Smash? Random test, yes we can. We did it before Nintendo. Mm-hmm. Let's not forget that. <laughs> I might miss the premiere due to practice and a competition today. Well, if anything, you will get the to get to see it later. Yeah, I don't get that. Why did he comment that? <laughs> like, why didn't you just watch it later? Cause he's loyal. Okay, I, I, I thank you. The copycat. If Bowser and Master Hand want a war, then they got a war, a multiverse war. Multiverse. <laughs> I I was... He got the scripts out of him, bro. I got... I was so... Oh, God. From Bobby! I've been winning so long. Smiley face. Laughing face. From Rosemary Manziano. Hi, Mom. I like this one. Good dialogue. 
you put a few funnies. A nice touch. You can. I'm hooked. You can tell that's your mom when she says something like a few funnies. <laughs> Thank you. Hope you're doing well, Mrs. Manziana. Thank Mrs. you, Stanley. Jesus, what an episode. The chemistry between the characters are so good. Oh man, this episode was amazing. Everyone did a great job. I can't wait for the next episode set by um, Crazy Hannah Creations. Thank you so much. This was definitely hard. Oh, hard. But Emmy, Link was the best actor by here, no cap. Oh, that's not true. That's why he went <laughs> to acting school. I, I went there for like three months. I, <laughs> like, I, I'm glad you guys like like my acting. I, I just, I don't know, I, I yelling. It works. If you want to sound smarter, be louder. From the Night Stalker. Who the hell is that fucking idiot? But us, just in my reaction, gotta say I was expecting this to be good, but not that good. Great start, and I'm sure it's only going to get better from here. This was so good. Good job, everyone. Said by Danny. And I'm like, thank, thank you, you, sis. Sir. Sis. Not sir. <laughs> thank uh, you, cisgender. <laughs> <laughs> Memento Mori. Link and Snake just argue about Rambo is easily the funniest moment. I agree. I improvised that and it became like the joke. That's why it's the joke. The joke. I love this comment. Bro, who would win in a fight? Snake versus Waluigi versus Link. By Profusion Studios. By Profusion Studios, my bad. And then you got Xander out here saying, Hmm, Waluigi, lol. And then Volpe saying, Wrong, Snake. And then myself saying, Wrong, Link. And then you got Knife Stalker saying, I'd actually agree that Snake wins. Haha, <laughs> at least at this point. I type in cap. <laughs> and you say, bite me, fairy boy. <laughs> From Layla. So, you have the capacity to edit the lightsabers, but don't edit out the orange tip on the guns. Ah, get over it, you fucking... Yeah, man, I don't know how to do that much tracking. No, do you realize how much work you're asking for? Like, listen, you want to edit out our, like, little orange tips? Do it for us. The copycat. So it begins, and a Bowser is getting ready to make okay. his big move, and didn't want to pay Waluigi for doing a job for him. Well, that makes him a douchebag. In my opinion, someone needs to get up in his face and tell him to go to that Pokemon devil. Oh my god, that's you, Reese. From the Night Stalker. Better, Better than, than Star Wars right now. Yeah, because what was this, Kenobi? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we're better than Star Wars. <laughs> Cosma. Cosma said, "Yo, this came out on point, but I'm still waiting for them driving vlogs, Shady." <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> I'm just gonna not do them. I'm gonna make a video called Drive. I'm gonna make a video where I'm walking up to a car and I'm about to get in it and I just flip off the camera like not today. <laughs> Marty Man 614. Marty Man! Thank you for also reacting to the trailer. Looking cool, Joker. I'll be posting a comment each and every week uh, to help document my thoughts and have them ready for the final reaction. Yeah. Which we saw your final reaction and I thought it was pretty cool. Mm. Random test. That ending honestly scared me. Haha, <laughs> good episode. Ha. Crazy Hannah creations. Whoa! Oh my gosh, I am shook on that ending. Lord was not ready for that. Poor Link. He can't catch a break. Also, the rest of the episodes was awesome. I like a lot of the characters. Hang out and train. Fight scenes were super great. Such a great episode. Can't wait for the next one. And Zenero said, I love that you're still reacting and that you're still watching. Hello, oh, poor Link. Meanwhile, Joker is bleeding. But yeah, trauma sucks. <laughs> <laughs>
Link needs to get a vacation. The whole episode was great. You did all a good job, said by his um, crazy hand creations. Oh, yeah, we did. Mike Mason said the following. Bro, the quality. At first, I was pissed that the show took as long as it did to come out. But you guys, um, but you can see you guys are levels above where you um, were when you did Snake. Uh, please take another year for your next project. This, um, so, um, so that your next project, I'm sorry, um, this, um, Hold on, I'm sorry, my dyslexia is acting up. Uh, please take another year for your next project. This film so far completely blew my expectations out the water. Let's go. I don't think we're gonna take another year, but you know. But like, we have high quality editing teams now for films, so. <sighs> we'll be better. My favorite thing about this whole show so far is honestly how much chemistry Link, Waluigi, and Snake have off of each other. My far favorite scene is just them hanging out at the beginning. It's slower, but so charming in a way. Big game! No. So here's the thing that I just kind of forgot about, right? Yeah. So this was a premiere. As in, if I look for it, we actually can see what the live comments were at the time. As is tradition. Yes, sir. All right, now we're on episode three, though. The best one. Yeah. Random test. Bro, Link is the fucking MVP of NCU. Jesus. Oh my yes. God. Yeah. Kind of yes. is. Kind of is. How many views did this episode get? 300, let's go, shit. Almost All a right. thousand. From the copycat. So Dark Link is back to darken Link's door, taking over Waluigi's body, pounding Snake virtually into the ground. And we all know Bowser will make his move real soon. But he'll always have an escape plan, just in case you take him down. As the old saying goes, he who coops and runs away lives to coop another day devil emojis okay <laughs> uh yes. i feel like that quote's yes, from indeed. one of the old mario shows like in the 90s i think that's what it is uh virtually pounding from whoa from to go bro bro <laughs> this video is fucking insane this video is fucking insane it's unique amazing i was asleep when this came out lol <laughs> Ooh, bro, the, time, the fight was a, <laughs> bro, the fight was amazing, but it was that scene towards the end that got me chalking up. Well done. <laughs> Anytime, Mike Mason. I, I, I guess you're talking about the Zelda scenes. So I appreciate that. Yeah. Hell yeah. That was great. From Marty Man. I'm really loving this so far, especially when <laughs> complicating about loss. Nice. Uh, from Crazy Hannah Creations. Whoa, this episode was amazing. The fight scene here was awesome. Cutting back um, to Waluigi and Darkling. The effects um, were amazing in this. I wonder who else oh. um, will battle within the next episode. Thank you. I edited this whole episode. <laughs> <laughs> this, uh, to be more specific, uh, so me and him worked on the timeline. I edited the music and the sound effects and um, some visual effects, but nothing like major. Uh, he did do the Waluigi Blast, but like primarily the VFX artist working on this one was my boy uh, Nick, who did the uh, Waluigi get like going super fast, like those trails. <laughs> um, my boy Ivan, who uh, did like the whole like Stranger Things look. And then Cole, of course, for doing the entire, like, Shadow Realm. And, like, some of the other VFX as well. Cool. Oh, I almost All forgot right. the story. The story worked on another VFX. <laughs> Alright, from Profi bleh, Profusion Studios. Andrew, I help you I help you with you first live-action Zelda film back in 2013. To see that and what you and the team have done with this... Is something short of inspiring, fantastic Thank job. Thank you, Jaden. Hey, high school Zelda. You know, it came out 10 years ago Dang. this month. 10 year anniversary. Oh my god. <laughs> Damn, bro. And then last but not least, from the Knife Sucker. 
Jesus, this was beyond anything you guys have done before. The whole Link versus Waluigi, Waluigi versus Dark Link fight was flawless. Great job, guys. You, you sound like Monkey Jones right now. You sound like Monkey Jones. I'm just gonna change this tab, okay? I do not. Fuck off. Alright. I'm gonna go look for your other video real quick. Our, our mid-season delay vlog. Yes. From Marty Man. Uh, you should do a style of fight um, scene that official Smash Bros has. With uh, the more you punch someone, the farther knockback they will recoil, and maybe invent some kind of random platform so one could have the high ground advantage. But I understand it may um, it may make the movie look bad in the fight. <laughs> will look a little goofy when adding wire work. If we can afford wire work. Trip my question, <laughs> my question is, uh, will we see sandbags from uh, the home run contest? I don't know if you know this, but all the actors were sandbags. No one was there. No one was real. Uh, it can be served as another layer of training or life and death situations if you fail to beat the record. Uh, from Memento Morty. Just letting you know, I'm going to be re doing a review of this series when it ends. Did he ever do one? I forget, I never checked. <laughs> I, you know what, just oh. real quick, just out of curiosity. Um. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> uh, okay, I'm gonna start here, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. From Crazy Hanna Creation. Ooh, this is awesome. I can't wait for the rest of the episodes. I have a fun question. What was your favorite scene to film in the Ultimate Smash Brothers film? Mmm. Good question. None, because I wasn't well, in Well, actually, it. you did have... Kemet versus Mario was my favorite well, scene Well, okay, the post yeah. Because it was fun actually seeing the effects get done for my fire blasts. But, like, what was... I, I think the question is more like, what was the funnest thing to film the day of? Day of Garage Rooftop. Okay. For me, probably... Uh, Kevin's death, Shadow Mario appearing. Uh, Darkling dying. Mm, oh, no, the white room. The white room was definitely my favorite day to shoot. Darkling. Oh, okay. Um, what's it called? But Reese, what about you? You do have, you are in one scene, technically, in the official movie cut. Technically. Technically. Um, the Mario one. Just before I forget. Yeah. Alright. I will say, uh, the uh, second take that we did with the postcard scene was by far the best when Nico fucking assaulted Bruce. Jesus Christ. So this is in our Mario vs. Wario video. I'm just gonna read these real quick. From MartyMan614, probably some deleted scenes, uh, from Smash, from the Smash Brothers show. You are right, because that is exactly what they are. Xenobra said, yes, and also of the tournament, um, and also the start of our tournament death battle. Um, and I said, of course, to be specific, this was originally supposed to be in episode two. I thought it broke pacing, so I cut it out. That being said, Xanabra um, stated it's going to be a great start to a, um, a tournament brawl. Go said noise. Um, Xanabra said amazing voice. Uh, Gray Rippin said, dude, in, um, dude in the traffic is going, what the fuck? And Xanabra said, uh, haha. Uh, the knife soccer said, uh, here are some options for the next fight. Master Hand versus Dark, um, Dark Link. Uh, Dark Link versus Shadow Mario. Uh, Master Hand versus Shadow Mario. Link versus Bowser. Ganondorf versus Master Hand. And Ga um, Ganondorf versus Mario. You want to know one fight that I've been seeing a lot ever since? Uh, Ghost. Master Hand. What Ghost uh, reacted to it? A lot of uh, Luigi versus Bowser. Ooh, that would be fun. Yeah. I would very much like yeah. to see a Link vs. Bowser. I want to see a Link vs. Bowser. I'll do it. What's up, Austin? I see you in the background. Oh, um, Reese says hi. He sees you. Oh. Hi. Hey, Reese. Yeah, we're know. just reading comments <laughs> at the moment. Oh, okay. All right, so uh, this is your turn. <laughs> From the amazing copycat, a beam sword fight literally on, a sh on the street and in front of... Sonny's Barbecue. I know, it says Sammy's Barbecue. I corrected it. <laughs> Your part-time job, Will. You have done it. A magnificent son of a goomba. 
two cosplay skits, one from Look I'm About Luigi Fighting, those dead Mario Ghost and Mario in the Universe, using a bomb to defeat Wario, that was fun, uh, blowing up in his face at a point blank range. I having a good birthday so far. Thanks for making a awesome Super Smash Brothers fan film. Happy birthday. Happy late birthday. <laughs> and thank you for the comment. Mm -hmm. Happy late day. Yes. Uh, from Trink. <laughs> One hour late, but this is amazing. And then from Gary Rippin. I like the bit when Mario grabs Wario's lightsaber. Okay, now well, we're thank you. Now we're done with this. Let's move on to the episode four. Yay! From Two Go Bro Bro, who was that hand? And I said, guess we'll find out. And I said that was ugh, obviously. <laughs> I, I don't even recall saying that, but okay. From Ultra Swag Time, let's a, fucking go. Fucking yeah. <laughs> Marty Man. I'm a little late in terms of this video, but yeah, it seems Mario may be stuck in the Shadow Realm. Ooh. Just like Jimbo. Who's Jimbo? Jimbo, it's time to send you back to the Shadow Realm. No! Oh. Looks like you're going to the Shadow Realm, Jimbo. <laughs> Jimbo, it's time Jesus to Jesus Christ, I think my favorite episode is still episode 3. But shit. Yeah, a lot right. of people we can't top it. <laughs> a lot of people seem to be like tied between three, four, and six. Three, yeah. four, five, and six. Because I know Reese really loves five. Yeah. But I, I, I don't think there's a question that three is like number one. But like yeah. the spot for number two always changes for everybody. <laughs> Sleek. I am at a marching band competition, but I want to <laughs> watch it. You're always somewhere where these things come out. But thank you. From the Knife Stalker. Best visual effects in Santa Bro history by far. By far. Shout out to Cole, and I also want to give a shout out to Ivan since he did one of the visual effects in this episode. Uh, and I think. And you, of course, did the lightsabers. Hell yeah. Uh, I. This is it my turn. Your turn. <laughs> From the copycat! My favorite guy! This reminds me of two things. One, episode 64 of Super Mario Brothers, when Mario throws fireballs at Ganondorf, when Mario attacks Kamek. And is that how you actually spell Kamek? Uh, because I've been spelling it K-A-M-E-K -E this whole time. That's how I spell it. Yeah, yeah. what the fuck? Uh, in that one scene. Two, uh, and the sky from Ghostbusters, the video game, alongside <laughs> with the whispering of the ghost world in the Wii and PS4 version. Your guys' work, um, your guys, your best work yet. Four, and for the record, Kimmick was acting like a real son of a Goomba in this episode, and Master Han is lurking in the shadows. Plotting, scheming, some big, evil, big time. Legendary. I'm gonna fucking aneurysm. Okay, let's move on the call solo. This must look really weird out of context, by the way. Our friend Austin just walked in in the background and he's just like doing whatever he's doing. And like he's just reading, uh, watching us read these comments, and I'm just acting like a fucking idiot, like, acting like I have dyslexia. Let's move on. <laughs> All right, from Mr. Cole Farrell oh. himself. So, all of the effects I, I did for this episode, episode one, one, the eternity of the Shadow Realm. You're <laughs> <laughs> the color. You're the Particle. And... <laughs> this lightning strikes. Lightning strikes. With help from Shady. I said all that right. And two, all bacon shots. Beams oh of light in the distance bacon. and drone shots. Actually, yeah, so one drone shot was, you know, ours. It was shot by David, but the other two were actually just stock footage we found on the internet of yeah. Orlando. You'll have fun with this in post for Four Mario. all Mario fireballs. Hell yeah. Oh, wait, you missed three. Three Chemex lightsaber burn and freezing hand. Not number five. Five, Kamek's fire block, magic, and a locating Waluigi spell. Six. All portal shots on a parking garage, which often include a mix of manual and automatic tracking. 
and symbol rotoscoping. <laughs> Huge shout out to the other visual effects artists for helping with all the other effects. This episode was not easy, and everyone's had to work paid off. I love you, Cole, so much, but why the hey, fuck hey, did you hey. make a giant comment basically saying, this is what I did, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> it's just you to make up for his tiny penis, woman. I don't know. Uh, hey, Brower. Hey, Brower. You're going to have a lot of fun doing this post production because I, I literally tried to, to talk over Cole's comment, but I forgot I muted myself. <laughs> oh, my God. What were you going to say? Oh no! Well, while while uh, Brower was reading Cole's comment, I was reading it at the same time. I thought he was like oh. interrupting me, but I'm like, I I'm like, I'm like, wait a minute, am, am I muted? Oh. Yes. You are. Well, here you can read this from the knife soccer. Oh Jesus Christ! Okay. Best visual effects in Xander Brown history. That no far. motherfucker, you reply to Cole. <laughs> wait, wait. Yeah. Cole? Oh, oh fuck. Great job, my man! And then, of course, by Brower. Well, I'll do Brower. The best VFX artist. All right. <laughs> my voice is not deep. <laughs> it's not that it's deep, it's that you sound like Mr. Fucking Murky. <laughs> okay. If you don't start saying McKay, I'm gonna be so mad. Okay. Exactly! Okay. Fucking, it works so okay. perfectly. Mr. Mackey, there was more comments. There were? I yeah. thought we did them all. all right. No. Yeah, no, wasn't this... Is this... Uh, oh! Oh, I'm no, stupid. I'm sorry. <laughs> From Danny. Good job, y'all. This turned out amazing because she's from Houston, Texas, and she sounds exactly like that because everyone from Texas sounds like that. Thanks. Hey, she's boy. Yeah, boy. Bye, Xander Brown. Profusion Studios. From Profusion Studios. Yeah, what do you say? I used to think Shady was the best part of Smash, but fuck, man. Brian is so damn terrifying and handsome when he <laughs> wants to be. And Cole is so damn talented, especially with VFXs. You guys and Brower are a power. I agree with that. I feel like when the four of us are power. together, we really do make some good shit. Yep, we gotta come together yeah. again and make another movie. I agree. I wholeheartedly agree. We should uh, make a comedy. Huh? We should make a comedy. You know what? No, we should make a horror. A horror comedy. Yeah, okay. Yeah, like something like yeah. similar to like Stranger Things or it. Uh, from Crazy Hannah Creations. Oh my God, that was amazing! It's so good to see you guys back. I can't wait for the next episode. Oh man, th this was an awesome episode. Everyone did a I'm such a good job. The effects are amazing. <gasps> Xander Brown said, "Thanks, Cole, aka Snake, uh, is the best effects artist. Mario vs. Kamek is uh, my favorite." Hello. <laughs> and then in Crazy Hannah Creation said, uh, nice, that fight was awesome and you're welcome. Let's move on to five. Thank you. Move on to five. And finally, from my comment I was supposed to read, best v VFX in Xanabra history. I read your comment like forever ago, but yeah. Oh, well, I, I, fuck you now. <laughs> <laughs> Just put it there twice in the editor or something. <laughs> All right, I'll let you take this All one. All right. From Money Man. I haven't looked at the video yet. I haven't looked at the comments yet. But please reply ASAP. I want to react to the final episode. And looking at the title, this could be the finale. If you can confirm that in the comments, I'll watch this video tomorrow and record my reaction. And I said, this is not the final episode. There is one more episode after this. So you're safe to watch this um, without a reaction video. Though, you will always be welcome to do one if you choose to do so. Oh, please do smash it. <laughs> you sound like Goo Lagoon. <laughs> so, my bad, I grabbed your hand. Oh, next time. Oh! <laughs> From Tink. This is amazing. From Ultra Swag Time. What, what was, was your favorite, favorite part? part? No fucking reply, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> Random text. You know what? See if he can respond to that. <laughs> Dude, Masterin is a badass, said random text. Hell yeah. A nice talk. You want to read your own comment? Uh, you can read it. I'm pretty occupied right now. Okay. The knife soccer said, uh, still confused on the Mario slash Shadow Mario shit, but this episode was tight. Tight, tight, tight. Uh, not quite as good as three, but is the second best. 
Pro Fusion Studio said, to be honest, it's confusing to me too. Hopefully the next episode clears, some, clears it up. Oh, Bowser putting his lightsaber in Mario is tight. It was probably lit. Tight. Like my ex. Like your what? Like, like your what? Like no, no Reese, like your what? Not <laughs> like my ex. Not like my ex. <laughs> like I thought you were going to say like your ass, man. <laughs> From Merman614, or 641. <laughs> I can't believe you killed off uh, Mario. That was so unexpected. No reaction today, but I'll record next week. I regret you not recording a reaction for five because that's probably Mario's the one where it's like, death. yeah. <laughs> Togo before. Yeah. This was a really cool episode. I feel like whatever the finale will end up being, it will be so epic to be honest. Aw. From Yankin Studios, great up From Yannick Studios. Bit. No, you go ahead. Great go. episode. A, a great episode. And although this is probably this has probably said already, I really like that you named this one Final Destination, my favorite stage. Yeah, Definitely that was one of all stages. his idea, actually. <coughs> Shut the fuck up. No, I will not. What? I will bless you. I was just saying bless you. Oh, sorry. Oh, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Someone. <laughs> <laughs> From, from, from Crazy Hannah Creations. Oh my gosh, this episode was awesome. I'm shocked at what happened. The fight scenes were great. Master Hand was a scary villain. It was scary for a villain. And a oh, Shadow Mario's back. This next episode is going to be crazy. I also love Snake's play that, um, play that was created by Snake. I also love, oh, oh, the drawing. Uh, yeah. That drawing was amazing. Yeah. Great job, everyone. From Cole Sorello. That drawing was actually doodled by me. So legit was created by Snake. From the Crazy Hand of Creation at Cole Sorello. That is awesome. It looks amazing. I had to pause and look at every detail of that plan. I cracked up at the master hand being a giant hand. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, Yay. Cole, that was a very smart idea to do on the spot. Oh, Jesus I Christ. It. I literally just did. Okay. <laughs> oh, hi, Mark. No, you gotta... For some reason... Wait, what? We'll get to it. We're gonna go in order. So, from Tinkit. Alright. Uh, man, I have to go back to school tomorrow. Screw that, man. I'm watching this. Best way to watch the finale, lol. <laughs> Let us know what you think. I agree. What? What, what do you think? Master Head pulling some major Jedi moves here and there, but Luigi taking him down like that, awesome. Snake using his sword and later holding the Master Sword. Really cool Bowser joining forces with them, as well as Master Han was being a big jerk to everyone. And those two gods playing the chess game, showing us all that some powerful people are always working behind the scenes. I told you that he would have to throw everything at the bad guys, including the kitchen sink. And I was right. Bringing Mario back in the last scene tells us those gods will be back someday, sometime, and somewhere. Aha, uh -huh, everything, everywhere, all at once. Go see the movie. Uh, just like the darkness said in the episode 64 of Stupid Mario Brothers, it's not over. I'll be back. <laughs> Thank you, Cuppy. I've your inspiring TED Talk. Mm -hmm. And you said, I'm glad you liked the lightsaber fight. Choreography was hella fun to do. Yeah, of course. So, anyway, from Merman614. What's the point of a lightsaber beam sword if you can touch the blade? part without it burning part of your hand. Well, in That's what the three, fuck I said. In season three of the Mortis arc in Clone Wars, the father touched Anakin's lightsaber and put it back in there so there are powerful beings that can do that. He's a god though, he's a yeah, god. Yeah, but to be fair, I also understand why you would think like someone like Luigi could do it. Yeah. So we need yeah. to explain that. We, we are explaining that in a phase Never two. underestimate Luigi. I yeah. am. What? Uh -huh. yeah. from, from a random test. Dude, so like, is there gonna be a sequel to this? And, uh, um, Jaden said, actually, yeah, is there a sequel to this? Uh, like, would it be a Smash 2 or something else? And you said, might be a Phase 2. So, that kind
kind of leads us to something else and I really hope you do splice this and make this kind of its own video yeah. because I don't think you've actually had an official announcement of phase two just yet. No. Yeah. So we would like to announce, or would you like to do it since this is your whole thing? I would like to announce that we have been currently filming this month, Solid Snake 2. <laughs> Because as you all know, in my high school original Nintendo playlist, it ended off with Snake 2 and Link 2, which were shit. Um, so about the final redemption arc would be Snake 2 and Link 2. After that, it's all new territory. But, but we are filming Snake 2 right now for Phase 2 of the MCU after Smash. Mm -hmm. uh, he shot it last week. Uh, about I would say about almost one third of it is done. Yeah, Actually Snake being two shot. Is Snake 2, one third is done. Yeah, and uh, I guess I'm gonna give some idea of what's happening next. So these are the projects that we're gonna confirm right now, which is Solid Snake 2, Link 2, and um, the Luigi Chronicles. Yes. Right? Those are gonna be the three. We And that's the big one, uh, Luigi I Chronicles. don't know if I wanna title it Luigi Chronicles, but I'm gonna think of a title for like the Luigi something. Yeah. Luigi in time, I don't know. <laughs> but this is gonna be basically what, this is kind of the redemption for Luigi Chronicles because that never came out. This is Luigi's story. Yes. <coughs> I like it. <laughs> <laughs> there, there are some other things too that are have been hinted at. Like obviously well, Luigi's still out there and um, obviously if you paid attention to the recent like NCU style videos, certain characters have been popping up. So. There are two other projects that are also in the work, but we are keeping them secret for now. We are building yes. up to something, and we will come to, um, come back and announce that to you at a later date. Watch both Christmas specials and let us know what you think. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> Nick coming. You motherfucker! <laughs> anyway. Before, before we move on, can you hear me when I talk like this? I can yes. vaguely. Yeah, okay, just making sure. From Crazy Hannah Creations. Oh wait, actually, yeah, this is your turn. Wowie zowie. Oh my gosh, what an ending. Holy mackerel. This whole fight scenes were great. Exclamation point, exclamation point. These effects were amazing. Ah oh, man, the ending had me <laughs> to the <feels>. Okay. Uh, <laughs> amazing job. For everyone who worked on the series. I don't know why I read it like that, but thank you, Crazy Hair, for uh, still watching us. So glad you liked the ending. Was hella fun to edit? No, it wasn't. And uh, this was <laughs> uh, this because we tried making the series for so long uh, a lot more fun uh, with a team of professional nerds. Uh, and Crazy Integration said, this was an amazing, fun series. Yes, it was. Uh, from the Night Stalker. For some reason, I never go. Wait, 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 wait. Let Reese read it. No, you guys right. read that. You guys uh, read that. All right, fine. For some reason, I never got a chance to comment on this LMAO, but great job, guys. It was great meeting you guys in Florida, and I can't wait for what you do next. Thank you, Quite Reese. I'm making a video. Thank you, guys. Yes, we made several fucking videos. <laughs> Anyway, from To Go Bro Bro, this was by far my favorite episode. Such a perfect ending. Thank you so much, Tyler. Um, from Yankee Studios, everyone did a stellar job in all departments. This was simply perfect. Great choreography, VFX were top notch. And the cinematography, it, it's clear that the team was passionate and everyone wanted to give their best performance. I'm looking forward to seeing your future projects because I know that you're going to smash it as well. And oh, yeah. you replied with... Like I smashed your mom. <laughs> yes. Thanks. I'm so glad you enjoyed our series. Been trying to make this since high school wall. Happy cried. Cole did the best with the effects. I also did good with sound. It's your picture of Cole. Yes, and we also did an amazing job on the new merch. Oh yeah, I, so yeah, please guys, like shout out to Nick for making this, but like please buy our new merch, it really would help support us 
Um, I like money, and obviously we're a bunch Go of to the website, guys, link so in please, the description below. Please give or me message money. me on Instagram. I, I want to be like Logan Paul and just like spend like a bunch of shit on a Bugatti. So like if you guys don't mind, <laughs> please make me very rich so I can just rub it in your face. Please, that's just all don't. I want to fucking do. Like more no, than anything. Let me flex SML. on a bunch of 11 year olds. <laughs> just, just don't be SML. Yeah. Well, that was Smash Bros. Reading Comments. Yo, video. but you thought we were done? Because we're we not. said we would do the whole fucking playlist. We have deleted scenes. Yes. Okay, so we don't need to do the full. Oh, wait, cast interview. Cast interview. Cast interview. All right. <laughs> the only comment is from Copycat. I'll Who read reads, this one. nice job. Thank you. Next question. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, yeah. I'll read yes, it. Uh, yes. I'll, I'll. Oh, wait, you're going to read it? Yeah, I'll read it. Oh. Okay. Oh. Okay. One, nice job on this. And as for Save the World being a multiverse drama, that would be the best way for a good ending for Unknown Plumber, as it became a cliffhanger because we all need we all need close clo closure. And Ganon and Ganondorf needs a good swift swift kick to his evil behind. Uh, two, I have noticed that Luigi and Link are always wearing green. Do those guys have some sort of beef with the ball? Oh, I, I know that reference. Uh, three, one hundred and eighty dollars for the white studio. That's dedication on your part to making this Smash Brothers fan film and just like it was at no budget productions, felt ferret productions. They basically no no budget to work with, but build great Star Trek TOS sets for the Star Trek fan films they made by <laughs> fans for fans. We have lightsabers. What's next, I wonder? Dark Link versus the Darkness? Oh my, they form an alliance sooner or later, then double cross each other eventually because they are just as greedy as Bowser, Ganondorf, and every other evil being in the multiverse. Okay. And that was a Yes. Thank you so much for acknowledging our cast interview. Let's move on. So, from Crazy <laughs> Hannah Creations, Oh, oh man, these deleted scenes were great to watch. From Santa Bro. Uh, thanks, Glenn, they were still fun. <laughs> you sound like a redneck, Shady. <laughs> from the copycat. Using music from The Dark Knight, really cool. Yes, you must always respect the green plumber, the Goomba, pissing off Kemic. Smarting off to him like that. Uh, that takes balls. Uh, thank you for uploading the deleted scenes. Gotta love. Got a Dark Knight phase while filming that. Got a Dark Knight. What? Did you just watch the Dark Knight? Yeah, I had a little Dark Knight phase when I was editing this. Oh, God. <laughs> uh, from the copycat. Dead Soldier Production used this music in Revelations to steal, um, to seal the orchestra episode 17 while... Carlos used the seal in Duel Against Travis. Uh, the, I, I have no idea what you're talking about, man. <laughs> Some movie out there. Yeah, you, ha happy you're doing that. And then from Random Test. It's kind of weird how a few scenes can really do so much for a project. These scenes are interesting in their own respects. However, I'm so happy that they were cut from the Final Cut film, uh, especially the Master Hand Shadow Mario scene and Final Luigi scene. Less is definitely more, and the film came out fantastic. Definitely Shady was the director idea person. I was the, ooh, that would be a cool writer person, lol. I'm uh, glad that we went um, with his ending. Yes, I am. Though, there is a director's cut coming out at some point. Uh, director's I'll be cut. I'll be real. If I was, like... If I was still 18 when this came out, I probably would still be bitching about the Shadow Mario and Master Hand scene. But now that I'm 20, almost 23, I can realize, yeah, it doesn't fit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Show of power okay. right before a powerful battle. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And now this right. is in our Link and Snake death battle, which is Ooh. canon. It's which is canon. canon. This canon. takes place after Smash. Uh... After Smash. I don't know, I don't even know how to attempt to read that name from... Termakay Terman 27 <laughs> Who should fight next? Well, you already did Mario against Wario, so why not finish the set with Luigi versus Waluigi? Ooh. Yes, both Luigi's. 
And if you can have a female fighters here, I've always wondered which princess is better, Daisy or Peach. You know that what? Isn't, uh, do Melanie Peach, we do have an option. You know what? Here's a random fight that I would just love to see for shits and giggles. Uh, because they're both technically in the same movie. Peach versus Otacon. Yes, <laughs> I do it. Yeah. I'm sorry, what? Peach versus, versus Otacon. Otacon. Otacon is briefly in Smash, and Peach is briefly in Smash as well. I would Let's say whoever wins will depend on the writer. I'll just say that. I think it's Otacon because of Gun. I think Peach because she has magics with her umbrella, and her umbrella is also a weapon. But she God, can also teleport. But God damn it, do Master and Shadow Mario. Yeah. Yes. From Coco Puffs. Oh, am I reading this? Or? It was really, really good. The only thing I would criticize is they would reverse the roles. I thought their voices would be more suited. And if it wasn't Snake, but another sword character, the sword fight was really good. And since Snake doesn't use a sword in Smash mm. Bros, getting an item. Also, Something uh, you don't have to read, but a link only yells. Oh! But this part doesn't matter to the story. Yeah, no, no. I remember this guy because, like, he got confused and thought, like, why are, like, a lot of context was missing yeah. because Link, um, Snake had the fucking Master Sword. Uh, Xanabra said, This is technically a sequel to our Smash Brother fan film, so um, things seem out of place, but why thank you. And I said, I was hoping our dialogue would explain um, it briefly for newcomers, but I'll have to take um, that down moving forward. At the end of Smash, Link um, gives the sword to Snake. Uh, he feels he moved past it. Um, that being said, <laughs> I don't know how, but I would play how I would play Snake, but that would um, have to be a fun role for it to play. Also, uh, yells, um, yells, I'm Haya. And uh, Coco Puff says, "Wait, uh, when and where um, does he give it to him? And in which, um, and in which Smash game?" I actually am really confused, and I really, really don't remember. And I said, "Not a game. This is a part of a web show called The Ultimate Smash Brothers. It's on Xander Bros YouTube channel." <laughs> <laughs> I got so fucking lost. And the oh, copycat man. said, who should, f um, who do you fight asking us? Peach, um, of course, versus everyone. Yes. That, uh, I'm sorry, but that's a very quick battle. <laughs> anyway, Peach wins, obviously. Obviously. Uh, oh, we had an official Smash movie premiere, and this guy, who I know Michael, does some Beavis. shit. Beavis! Beavis oh. 100! I'll let you read it. Uh... Ah, uh, that's so cool, man. I've always wanted to do a premiere like this. Looks hella fun. Uh, was so much. Shady found the thea um, theater in his friend's complex, and I said I had to call in so many favors to organize this, but without a doubt, Smash is our biggest budgeted film, so I wanted to make it as big as I possibly could make it. I honestly couldn't believe how big Smash got. Same. I'm still getting bigger. Bigger than yeah. Venus. Oh, well, that's a pretty big tall order. Uh, the <laughs> Ultimate Smash Brothers full blooper reel from the copycat. Oh I my! I, I will. I, I got. I got. I, yeah, bro, bro, yeah, yeah. Hold on. I'll hold you back. I got this, Brower. Most excellent bloopers. A tour came through um, as you were filming. Uh, well, that that is a weird. Um, that's weird timing. Waluigi wears purple and Link wears green. It's like Grove Street Family versus Balas. Uh, what the. Fuck is he talking Damn. about? Uh, for Link with a gun, uh, he may be picking up Snake's bad habits, but who knows? Thanks for the bloopers. Get back here, bro. Thank you for watching the bloopers. Okay. Context. He was talking about GTA San Andreas. Oh, okay. Those are, those are the main groups. <laughs> From Crazy Hand Creation. Uh, these bloopers are amazing. So much fun to watch. Even love some segments of behind the scenes parts. It's such a cool process to see. And ding, ding, ding. last but not least, is there anything from the full movie? No, there is not because I've re-uploaded it several times. So, and on, but, and on listed. but there is something from the full movie from my friend April. From right over here. Well, bam. All right, do you want to read that? Sure. Luxury Master, hi April. I just watched this whole series and noticed I never made a comment on it. I just wanted to say this channel really came a long way. 
and grew so much, especially with the quality. Love the choreography and the effects that really come together. Not to mention, bringing new characters to the series. I really like how there's a Nintendo Cinematic Universe going on here. Now, what I will say, and I hope uh, criticism is okay. Yes, please. Uh, I see Beam Swords is something that's been a thing for a long time. I'll be honest, I like them at first, but seems a little played out. I would like to see more use of other moves for each character. Hell yeah. I would agree. Uh, like yeah. the Mario Bros and Waluigi can do some much more. So much more. So they don't really need uh, beam swords in 5932. Making a callback to Mario's final smash was amazing. Thank you, Cole. And would love to see more of this in the future. Another thing, it would be amazing if there were more new fighters in the main group. It's cool seeing Link snake, but it would be amazing if there were more characters in the main group. Overall, this was such a great series and look forward to the next one. Very good job to the team for putting this together. Can I? Thank you, uh, April. You met us when we were filming Brower vs. TO2, the Padawan pack. Let me uh, kind of address that for a second. So obviously, you should kind of go without saying that at this moment in time, we're building uh, the Nintendo Cinematic Universe to be even bigger. What, whatever Phase 2 is going to like consist of or whatever we're building towards. We don't know what. But um, there is one thing that I will confirm right out the get-go, which is we are expanding the team. It's not... Like, the 4 is definitely going to be, like, the important, like, the original 6 Avengers. But, like, obviously, we're going to bring in new characters. We're going to do this. We're going to do that. And I'm just excited, and I hope you guys like what's in store and who we're bringing in. Because... If you watched our specials, you might have an idea as to who. Hell oh, yeah, Christmas specials, both of them. Hey. But thank you guys for watching you this. Read all <laughs> of your comments. Yep. Thank you, and please leave uh, more comments in all of our videos. It's a lot of fun. And whatever. Subscribe else. to Shady. Ah! And subscribe to Knife Stalker. Ah! Hey. And peace out up in here. That's my thing. Ma